here's Krita and it's a free software I really like it a lot just because it's so usable and um, actually looks good if you right click on your mouse it'll sometimes work <laughs> um, you will get this cool menu where you can probably you can change out the brushes work on your opacity and pick colors right from there all right so how do we get our tablet to work right now with my pressure sensitivity and using a fountain pen um, you can see that if I touch really lightly and I'm barely touching it'll do that but the the hardness is so close that I really can't get a dramatic line there's close to a good line so what we have to do is change our preferences for the pen so go to preferences it's right under the Krita button and it'll say preferences it'll open this it'll usually open up to general click on tablet settings and put a dot here and pull down and this will make your pressure sensitivity a lot more where if you do a light touch it'll be really light if you do a harder touch it'll get darker okay so let's check it out so now that I'm lightly touching it looks more like a ballpoint pen really light and this is me barely touching the tablet which is what it's supposed to do so this is still light but now watch if I go light to hard light to hard light to hard it makes it more of a dramatic line so that's what it should do and it should feel like pen and paper and so that's kind of how I adjust my sensitivity on Krita to make it where I can draw and paint a lot better and so this is a quick little tu tutorial that will help you <laughs> with your art experience um, using this free app it's one of them it's a really great app and I just love it so I really encourage you guys to check it out um, explore the different brushes they have them organized and so everything's pretty easy other details that's pretty much what, what you need to get started you can right click on your mouse to get up close view of the same stuff over here but it just looks a little bit more fancy um, can you change the brushes not sure I have not tried but you, you must be able to I just haven't experimented with it even that is interesting there's so many cool things on Krita that are a little bit different than Photoshop or Adobe and it just is really user friendly for sketching and painting so I'd encourage you to download Krita and also make sure your Wacom tablet works on it so that's pretty much it for today if you like it please subscribe talk to you later